Hello everyone, and welcome back to Quest for Glory 5. We're, uh... Okay, I was like, why is the music broken in the tavern? No, it's playing one of the other tracks. There are four tavern tracks. Would you like to be the champion? It will cost you 500 drachmas. You won two bets for 4,500 drachmas each. Dang. Also, I cannot place a bet on Magnum down here, unfortunately. Um, so yeah, that 4,000 drachmas already. So, um, yeah. I absolutely want to place bets on myself. Um, just all the way through. And why not? I know I'll make all this money back, so there we go. All four fights, I bet 1,000 drachmas. <laughs> so I'm going to be rich by the end of this week. All right, well, uh, so this episode is going to be the Coliseum episode then. Because I'm just, what I'm going to do in that case, so that I'm sure I don't miss any, is I'm just going to go ahead. I'm going to go to the Coliseum. I'm going to do a fight. I'm going to rest until the next day, and then I'm going to go to the Coliseum, I'm going to do a fight, and I'm going to do that all four days, and then be done. But then we'll be done with the Coliseum, so that will be great. <coughs> so, if Magnum Opus was still alive, we'd get one more, you know, we'd get five fights. But unfortunately, we're on right six, and obviously he died at the end of right two. So, not really a lot we can do there, fortunately. I have to pick weapons for our uh, big fights today. You fight. Go arena, fight start. You fight. Go arena, fight start. You fight. Go arena, fight start. So yeah, basically we go over to the arena here. And we're like, hey, you know, I want to fight. So I walk over here to the arena. I double check that I have everything that I want to use. Um, let's see. Abdul uses a sword. Well, no, I, I guess I still can't do that, can I? Because if I do the sword, axe, spear thing, I can't end up really... Because I don't have a spear opponent, so I can't do that. Um, well, you know what we do have? We have four weapons and four fights. So, let's do that. We'll start with our Dragon Slayer Sword, and we'll make our way down to our Paladin Sword. Go! Go! My greetings to all of you. <coughs> In tonight's Battle for Excellence, we have the final champion of these contests. Here is a man who has proved his skills in many lands. From the brigands of Spielberg to the deadly elementals of Shapir, he has mastered the art of intelligent combat. From the demon worms of distant Tarna to the hideous wraths of Mordavia, he has demonstrated his talent for survival. Ladies and gentlemen, <coughs> I summon to battle the Prince of Shapir. Our champion is challenged by the finest of fighting guards from the city of Rasir. I summon to battle Abdul. I don't think I've ever done Abdul's intro. You make bad. No, I have. Mistake. I like this you one. Don't belong here. No. Get you! I break you in bits. I think that just because this is the last time, I will let um, every one of my opponents get their introduction. Um, again, just because this is the last time that any of them will get a chance, you know, that we'll get a chance to see them. So.
Win! The victor of tonight's battle is the Prince of Shapir! Yay! 500 drachmas for winning. Along with the thousand plus whatever that I'll get from winning the bets. <coughs> so that'll be nice. All right. Off to uh, home, actually. All the end. I suppose I could just use the Mystic Magnet now that I think about it. There we go. Sleep for eight hours. Bling! And we have to stop at the Dead Parrot Inn every time so that we can make sure that we get our winnings and see how much money we make. And we've got 1,301 drachmas currently on us at the moment, so... And we gotta stop and eat at No Man's Inn because it's free. You realize I've had this fruit now for a month and it hasn't gone bad? I wish there was a way to skip her, like walking over to you and walking away from you and so on. At least you can skip the uh, the eating so that she just immediately starts walking away, but it's like, ugh. Wish I could skip everything else. Skip her walking, skip talking to her, skip everything. Because it's, it's like, I've seen all of this now. I'm only doing it because it's free food. And I'm too greedy. That's a fun concept, a paladin that's greedy. Say, I must have money. I must have all of the monies. Like, you don't understand, I need all of the monies. <laughs> you know? I need all of the monies. I have an 8,000 drachma sword that I have to buy for absolutely no reason. I need all of the monies. I have to take medication. I have to take a lot of medication actually because I have a lot of problems. Let's see, I've got tyrosine, which is a, it's a nerve medication. It's, it, it basically helps with like severe anxiety by regulating the nerves better. Um, then I have, those are my probiotics. I'm not entirely certain what they're for, but that's what the doctor has me on. Really? I only got 200 drachmas from that? Lame. Because remember, I bet a thousand. So getting a thousand back means that I only got whatever extra. So I only got 200 drachmas for winning that one. Bet a thousand and I got 1200 back. <coughs> lame. Very lame. Alright, let's see which weapon are we using today. Wormbane Spear. <coughs> got 2000 drachmas though. Around with my actually, I probably should not have my weapon out. So the guards aren't gonna like attack you because you have a weapon out, but they're gonna freak out and be like, "Oh no, I have to defend you because you're gonna attack me." And I'm gonna be like, "No." <laughs> they only react when you have a weapon out, though. They won't won't react to anything else. So, <sighs> yes, I want to deposit all of my money so that I can see how much I have. Four thousand, not bad. Not bad. We'll get 500 more from winning this fight. Okay, now I can equip my spear. I wonder if I can even do that. Like, if I use the zap spell on it, like, is it gonna, like, am I gonna have the zap spell on it when I go into the arena? 
The only one way to find out, I suppose. That's to uh, zap it and then see what happens. So, zap bonus. I do still have the zap bonus even after an hour's rest. So, I'll we'll see. I will skip over mine just because it is really long. <laughs> Yay! Our champion is challenged by a giant of a man. I summon to battle Gort. Gort. Mm. May the contest begin. I wish that like each one of the characters that you are challenging though, like like how, you know, when you challenge the champion, the champion is there. I wish that when you were the champion, that the, yeah, that bonus, that the, uh, the people that you were challenging were there to talk to, you know? And it's like, I have, you know, and they're like, I've come to challenge you, you know? That would be fun. But nope. You just walk in, and then just walk into the arena. Naturally. 500 drachmas. Excuse me, sorry. Mmm. I just used E again to open my inventory because Minecraft. Late for eight hours. <sighs> Alright, time for our third arena fight. You know what? I'm not even gonna bother eating today at No Man's Inn. I have food. I'm just gonna do that. I'll just eat my own food for once. How much food I got? Still 15 more pieces of fruit. So... At least I don't have to manage my weight. Of course, in Mabinogi, fruit makes you lose weight, so it would be okay, even if I did have to manage my weight. My offense went down. Oh, because I unequipped my weapon, duh. Of course. Five. Go check our winnings. We are the champion. Probably what I'll label this episode because, you know, for the, the musical joke, 1500, not bad. So I got 500 off that one. Not bad. I think it's based off like what the people are betting and you know more people were betting for me that time than they were Abdul so therefore I got even more like I'm sure that if I understood the chart there that um, it would tell me like oh yeah this is what you're gonna get and I could, like, not spend a thousand drachma only to get 500 back, you know? But, I don't know. I don't know if betting a thousand is the only way to get the maximum back or what. You know? Like, if I had only bet 500, would I still get 200 back? I don't know. So I just bet a thousand because it's the most I can bet and I'll get the most back. You're getting hungry. How about that? Maybe fruit doesn't uh, last all day. Time for the X. There you seem to be worried against most magical effects. One moment. There you go. 
They will now deal extra damage for the first hit. Which totally matters for reasons. Go. My greetings to In tonight's battle. Our champion Elsa challenged by a skilled and experienced combatant. I summon to battle Elsa von Spielberg. I, Elsa von Spielberg, shall prove my skills upon the field of combat. May the contest begin! Here we go. Bam! Zap spell. Elsa's like, what the crap? How did you get magic in here? Can you just die? Thank you. My god, she was actually hitting me pretty hard there. You're Luna. 2000 Drachmas. Yay! 500 Drachmas. I wonder if we've hit our 8000 yet. Really love to hit that 8,000 before doing the final fight. Just because I'd like to not use the Paladin Sword, you know? I'd like to get that Ice Diamond Sword and use it. But I have 2,500 on me, but that would mean I would need uh, like 4,500 in the bank, I think. I might have that though, the, I'm thinking about it. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and eat here since it's obvious that that's like the best thing. Her meals last all day. Fruit does not apparently. The soup for Lobster brisk. You eat it quickly, Katenda. At least you didn't pay anything for the food. I mean, I guess there's that much. My tooth feels funny. Hmm. It's got the feeling of like... Like there's something wedged. And my tooth or something, you know? It's a really annoying feeling. Figure if I just go talk to Folus, I'll find out how much I have. So. Ah! Dang it. 6,445. I mean, I'll have it after this, but... Uh, I really wanted to get that. And Folos closes at like 5, so I can't even get into the Dead Parrot Inn and get the money and then come out. You know? Closes at either 5 or 6. That's why I think I'll get 2,000 drachmas in that line, you know, from this anyway, but I think I only need like 15, but, well, a little over 15. Yeah, I only got 15, so I am still short by, even if I had, even if I could go see Fullus, I would still be short by like 5, so. Ugh. Oh well, what can you do, I guess? But yeah, full is closed by now. See? Oh well. I tried. Tried to get the Ice Diamond Sword before um, 
arriving at this point, but oh well. Definitely did not have enough money to do it. Oh, well, I guess such is life. Guess we'll just use our paladin sword. As much as I really wanted to avoid using the Paladin Sword in the Colosseum, but oh well. If Magnum were still alive, I would get a chance cool. to use the Ice Diamond Sword. My greetings to all of you. Welcome to the arena. Also, the unfortunately, Magnum is not alive, so we don't get to see Ferrari's final speech. He actually has a specific speech for day 30. But because Magnum's not alive, we don't get to see that. Challenged by a monstrous Minotaur, I call to battle Toro. Toro fight. Toro fight. May the contest, contest begin. begin. But yeah, he has a special speech for the day thirty. Fight. Ow! <laughs> that fountain sword is just ridiculous. That's just how OP the fountain sword is. That's why I didn't want to use it during this fight. Because it is so OP. Oh well. What can be done? Well, that's it for the arena. Tomorrow we'll go collect our winnings and uh, head off to the right of peace. So I do hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, feel free to subscribe. Feel free to check the video description down below for a link to the playlist so that you can get caught up on any episodes that you might have missed. And with that, I will see you guys next time. See you later.